all right what's going on guys come back no video it's mike here today i'm gonna be showing you a really really nice package you can install via npm and it's called react copy to clipboard and if you don't know how to copy and paste uh, a text uh, or whatever info you want to your clipboard you can do that with this component and with the help of this video today okay guys so before we start make sure you give this video a thumbs up make sure you subscribe for more react and coding content and without further ado let's show you guys what i did for you okay first of all I'm gonna empty my clipboard so to empty your clipboard in windows you're gonna have to go to your settings and just uh, find uh, this clear clipboard data and press on clear so make sure your clipboard is empty so i have here a empty uh, text area and once i uh, click on ctrl v there's nothing getting pasted into this uh, you know text here text box and when i click on paste there's nothing on here okay this is not enabled but once I click on copy address below to send transaction, okay, and send transaction, whatever. And if I click on this one and it got copied, and when I go over here, you can see that something got copied to my clipboard. And when I click on paste, here you go, I got the address over here. So Ctrl V also works. This is it for our demo, guys. If you're looking forward to know how to code this, keep on watching this video. Let's get to coding. In this series, I review React packages by using them in a simple example and I show you the best use cases for you to try. You can find all the references in the description of this video. Subscribe to my channel today and turn on your bell notifications for more content like this one. Okay guys, so I'm on here on visual code and I have the code in front of me and I'm not gonna code along with you. I'm just gonna explain to you the code because it's very, very simple to understand. Okay, you just have, uh, you just need common understanding of React and that's it. Okay, so uh, I have a component which is called React Copy to Clipboard because I'm pushing this code to GitHub. So if you need the code, you're gonna find it in my GitHub, okay? Uh, links in the description, by the way. First of all, go ahead and install this package which is called React Copy to Clipboard with NPM. So I'm gonna have uh, this link also in the description down below. So go ahead, NPM install, uh, save React Copy to, cl to Clipboard, okay? Once you have that, you can go ahead and uh, if you want also read documentation for this one, but I have the code ready for you. I'm just going to explain it. So once I you import it, okay, and you have to declare a constant and uh, this uh, const is just a state uh, which is false just to tell me that this, uh, you know, text got copied. Okay, and that's it. I have a normal div with a container. I have this h2 tag and I have this component over here. This is the most important part of this code. So this component is called copy to clipboard and you get you have it from this import statement and you have the text. So this is the text or the like the data you want to be copied, okay? Uh, most likely it's going to be a text, guys, okay? So the text over here I, is this one, the address, okay? And it's hard coded over here, okay? In my case, I have to hard code it because it's uh, really simple. And dynamic things, uh, I guess you can pass a prop, okay? And just put it here if it, you want it dynamic, but it's very, very flexible, okay? And you have this callback function on copy, and this uh, on copy, so once you click, okay, on uh, on wherever you want to click on, it can be a button, it can be a uh, anything like over here, it can be a span, okay? So on copy, and it triggers this function, which uh, is gonna switch the state from false to true, Okay, so I know when this text got copied, okay? So once the user clicks on it, on copy, it's gonna trigger it from false to true, okay? And I have a button over here, and it has its styles in the, in the CSS file, and I have this text for the label of the button, and I have another ternary uh, expression over here, and it says, if this clipboard state is true, please render this copy text over here, okay? I didn't style it really well, but uh, we're only here for this uh, component, okay, guys? And I have this h2 tag, I paste it here, and this text area, okay? And that's that's it. This is it, okay, guys? Very, very simple. I'm going to save this, go back, okay? Refresh that, and I'm going to empty my clipboard, and uh, this component automatically, once you click on it, okay, it copies this text, which is this one, okay, guys, this string over here, it copied it, okay, not this one, this is only the label. If you want to copy anything, guys, you have to put it in here, in the text property, okay, over here. So, once I go back to my browser, I can paste it over here. I can paste it literally anywhere, in my browser, okay, wherever I want, I can paste it, even in my code editor, 
okay guys it just got copied to my clipboard as simple as it sounds okay and that's pretty much it guys very very simple code to understand very useful component also to use in any you know project you have productive project and uh, yeah you have it guys thank you guys for watching it's been mike make sure you give me a thumbs up and stay tuned for more content because i'm gonna have a lot of components coming up on my channel okay see you guys in the next video